Okay, so this is the trailer for the new Big Games game. I was just going to pause it there because what I'm going to do in this video is show you everything that you've missed and all of the details that are coming to the new Pet Simulator 99 game. So this trailer is 2 minutes and 53 seconds long. We are going to start it. Now, if we pause it because there is a lot going on here. So over here, let's try and zoom in. This says Cologne exclusive pets and transfer eggs from Pet Simulator X. That machine there is going to be the machine you first use when you start the game and bring in all of your pets into the new game. All right, let's move on. What else is on the screen here support us get rewarded so over here this is just the usual thing where you probably verify your twitter and then you get like a 10 percent boost 50 percent boost is there anything else on here that we've missed there is this thing here i think it just means click coins to get coins there is something at the back there wait 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 let's zoom in a little bit further what is this over here i don't know what that is but we're gonna find out because further in the video there might be some more info on that however this thing here does it like a portal okay so this trailer opens up at the beginning of the game and then we're here tap the coin Okay, so we've got Preston here. This reminds me a lot of a swarm simulator, right? I mean, like the little patches where you can mine stuff. If we look down here, so down here is your normal icon for all of your pets, which is a cat in Pet Simulator X. But in Pet Simulator 9, it's kind of like this four pet button, which looks pretty cool and modern. So over on the left, instead of on the right, we've got our number of diamonds, number of coins, and there's a few different buttons here. It looks like there's a hoverboard, which is locked. I don't know what this point clicker thing is here, but we're going to find out later in the video. On the right, we've got a reward system, a rank system, and some current challenges such as break 10 coins. So let's continue the video. All right. So straight away, you can already see that it's very similar at this stage. However, things are about to change massively in this trailer. So let's keep going and see. All right, we've got at the top, the rank progress just popped down. It's transparent. That is also new. And quest completed there. We earned one star. Now, I don't know what stars are at the moment. However, it must be another form of currency. They're not on the left. There's coins. They're not on the left. There's gems. But somewhere, the stars do something else. Possibly unlock stuff in the rewards on the right here. But we're about to find out some more. So let's keep going. All right, so he is, oh my gosh. So he's just unlocked the next area. Area two, 900 bucks. It looks like you can get through in the same way as the old pet simulator. We've even got the same starter buildings on the right. We've got the orange and the red uh, apartment buildings. Everything looks kind of the same at the moment, but we're gonna unlock the next area and see what happens. Okay, everything just shook and the glass smashed. That was much more rewarding. This is the next area. And if you notice, it's got the same boxed off area so let's watch what preston does what whoa, 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 whoa. so now the camera just panned around and we can see behind preston which is the shop just like it is in pet simulator x however it looks much more grander i guess and wait what is this on the right okay this is the mailbox it has just been imported straight over from pet simulator x it looks exactly the same even the fountain there but this layer of eggs the way it spans out into like into the distance the fact that there's so many all in a row this looks so much better than previous however there is this weird new board up here which is probably like an advertising board hatch huges from your best egg wait 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 let me zoom in a little bit more this is as far as i can zoom on my program it says hatch huges from your best egg i don't know what this says it's too blurred and this i don't know what it says but it looks like a four to five hour kind of thing that's refreshing this pet for sure i've not seen before this is the huge giraffe that we saw in the hole and this, I don't know what this is, so we'll comment down below. Other than that, this looks pretty familiar, a bit like Pet Simulator X, but let's move on and see what happens next. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. What was that? What did he just go up to? He's gone up to some... Oh, wait, this... There, let's rewind a bit. There, there, there. He's gone up to this thing, which is a... Oh, move faster. So he's unlocked a movement ability. Instead of on an upgrade machine, he's kind of like picked it up as he's gone along. So let's see what happens. There, plus two walk speed. So these kind of upgrades are progression as you go through the game rather than using the upgrade machine to buy them, I assume. We'll find out. Let's, let's see what happens next. All right. He's just smashed through to the next area. He's earned a couple of new stars and we are now in area three so if you notice the areas at the moment are just numbered one two three and the next area is area four strangely in this area there's the unlock bit for ten thousand coins but there's also a padlock on the left here so we're gonna find out what that means let's keep playing and see oh wait 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 what was that that was your free diamond so that was your that could be a vip reward or that could just be a normal reward for logging in every th half an hour and, and get some free gems okay let's keep going and see what happens yo wait 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 the graphics seem to be much more cute and cartoony i don't know if you can see but the explosions everything is much more cute it almost wait i'm not even gonna say it let's keep going okay so he's just smashing coins and whoa 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 equip more pets machine so for a start there is a robux purchase thing here at the moment it only shows zero wait let's fast forward a bit 
No, no, it doesn't show the amount, but let's go back. Let's slow this down a second. Here, this is the use more pet machine. So it's kind of like an upgrade machine, but just for more pets. Let's see him go in there. Okay, 15 more pets equipped pass. It's going to be robots, clearly. But you can increase the size of your pet team. Oh my gosh, this is what 99 means. Pet simulator 99 means you can have 99 pets. At the moment, he's got four of 99, but you can get 99 pets in total. That is why it's called Pet Simulator 99. That is insane. That is crazy. You're going to be able to equip 99 pets, but to get 99 pets, looks like you're going to have to do all of these tasks. So each pet you equip, you're getting one of these pet collars. So one pet collar is one plus pet equipped. 250 gems so you can buy it it gets more and more expensive to get to the next stage you need rank two at the moment he's just rank one a noob so this is interesting it's gonna be kind of free to play but paying robux will get you 15 to give you as they say get a head start pay to win cringe pay to win cringe time all right let's keep going oh my gosh he just scrolled all the way down hold on hold on he just scrolled all the way down to rank five there's your 99 pets right there. Oh my gosh. What's at the bottom? There's something at the bottom. Let's see if we can slow it down. Let's slow it down to 0.25. There. This is the next bit. So this is a completely new system. This is the inventory. I got no idea what this does, but we're going to look into it. So this is the brand new inventory system. Here he's got speed one basic. Increase your walk speed by plus four. You tap to activate it. So I imagine he's picked this up somewhere. And then there's this rank system, which all seems to be linked and unlocks as you go further and further ahead. Down here, you can also buy more things. Wait premium enchant slots so these enchants are these for the pets or are these for you i don't know but we're gonna find out the other thing i noticed on here is in the inventory you can quickly go between your pets your potions your quests there's your hoverboards and your eggs oh that's interesting i wonder if they're gonna keep pets and eggs separate probably now what's this down here this is chests this is strange all right let's keep going and see what happens next oh did you see that he clicked to activate it and it went into his inventory so it looks like you can hold five special abilities at once this one is walk speed and as you progress through the ranks you then have the ability to equip five different enchants maybe all five of them could be speed we don't know what other ones there are yet but let's keep watching to find out okay this is just insane this looks so cool this is the beginning of the shop that we saw earlier but from the perspective of the player and look how many eggs there are so there's nine on the first row and then 10 on the second row and then it seems to go up in tens because they're all numbered like 16 17 18 9 in this egg there are three mysterious pets with question marks so let's see what happens when he opens it did you see that let's go back one frame let's go back one frame there so we've got a b that thing and what looks like the scarecrow pet so he is gonna would you like to buy a hive egg for 8k so this is just a traditional buy your egg screen so we'll keep going oh there was a honeycomb the honeycomb has to be did anyone see that that was insane that is sick maybe they're all honeycomb i, I don't know but that looked pretty cool all right so he's got a bee yo he's got a squirrel wait 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 let's go back a bit because i just saw a frame let's do that okay enchants would you like to buy a random enchant so we've seen the speed one this thing here is a generic symbol for enchants you can buy one you can buy two you can buy three so i think this doesn't enchant the pet i think this enchants you let's press play look at that the enchant machine is shaking watch watch did you see that that was so cool let me let me go back a little bit because i watched closely look at the machine it's shaking anyway we're on to rank rewards so at the moment he's a rank new rank rewards now we've got one to nine things here he seems to have claimed all of them okay there's the speed book from earlier the speed enchant these look like potions these are bag of coins probably free gems and coins but down here it looks like you can get the hoverboard i'm actually gonna say you can actually get the hoverboard for free no way it looks like the hoverboard is free it looks like this is a mixture of pet simulator 2 and pet simulator x with free to play elements and pay to win elements it's worth noting here that david has just joined the game as well he is the guy that made at my restaurant let's keep going and see what he does in the screen all right he's just claimed the hoverboard wait 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 he just claimed the hoverboard for what looks like for free you own a personal hoverboard gotta go fast uh, it's just a basic hoverboard so there's obviously going to be some more better hoverboards which we're going to get to soon so let's keep going all right ranked up he just ranked up to number two beginner okay he's got some rewards for that which are bags of money and another kind of enchant so let's keep playing and see what oh wait 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 he's just gone to a new area he is in hold on hold on hold on upgrade potions combine into better potions you can now craft new potions in the upgrade potions machine okay let's watch what happened oh, wait, wait wait it's gone it's gone right that, that happened so quick i'm gonna rewind and we're gonna watch that in slow motion yo 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 hold on hold on i've just seen something else this is a fruit machine buy random fruits we'll have to find out later in the video what that means but 
Let's play this bit in slow motion. So he's going into area, what well, looks like area 14 because we've got area 15 in the background. In this area, he's gone over to the upgrade potions machine, make these new potions. And they're, oh, look at that animation. That is sick. Success, you've crafted new potions. So no idea what it does yet. It just says X2 on it. Could be speed, could be coins, could be anything. Let's keep watching. Wait, there is also a free potions area where you can claim free potions, a bit like where you claim rewards at the beginning of Pet Simulator X. All right, let's keep going in slow motion. Hold on. So he's just collected a couple of new potions there. They have different star ratings on them as well, which is a bit like the three star, two star thing on pets from Pet Simulator X. All right, let's keep going. Uh, okay, okay. This looks sick, whatever it is. Some kind of treehouse. Anyway, we're going to keep playing this in slow motion, I think. But let me turn the volume down because that music is just annoying in slow motion. All right. He's back in the Equip More Pets machine. If you notice at the top left, Preston is typing. He is known as God. He says, I am recording for the trailer. Leave or I'll kill you. Wait. David says, oh, Godspeed. And then he's obviously left. So this trailer was actually recorded by Preston himself. In fact, in a tweet, Preston actually said, I made the trailer, so that's how you know it's good. Okay, back to the trailer. He is back in the Equip More Pets machine. He has now got seven out of 99 pets, and he's going to unlock some more. So watch this number go up. Yes, eight. It went up to eight, but we're now in the next area. This trailer moves pretty quick, so this is why I'm playing in slow motion and analyzing every scene. So this looks like some kind of summer area. At the moment, you can already see he's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen pets equipped, and they're basic pets. Thirteen pets equipped, and he's just a rank three rookie. You will be able to rank up pretty quick in this game and get rewarded much faster with more pets without paying to win just by doing things in the game, which is interesting. He's actually made a game this time rather than just a money collection machine for himself. I like money. Let's go to the next area. Wait, 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 wait. This just is exploding before we even get to see it. This is some kind of portal to the next area. There is some kind of loot thing over here. I don't know what this is, but there's a banana. There's an apple. There's a percent chance of what? I guess hatching any of these things? I don't know, but let's see what happens when we press play. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Did you know? Make videos and you can be a partner with us. <laughs> Bro, I've been making videos on this game for over two years and I'm not a partner. Anyway, this is an obby. This is an actual obby. If you see this sign here, that means danger. Death is coming. There is green slime everywhere. The floor is lava, but it's not fire. It's green lava. So he's got a timer. There is a timer down here. So there must be a time limit or a time that you can hit and compare it with your friends. So let's watch him do this obby. He's doing it in slow motion. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We've just gone somewhere else. So I think he's done the first 10 seconds of the obby. We're out in the 13th second. Danger, falling rocks, take cover. So watch this. This is some Indiana Jones stuff right now. There's, did you see that? Oh my gosh. He's getting chased by a rock. He's now 49 seconds into the obby and it is getting even more Indiana Jones style. This is almost piggy style as well. He has got a dodge. These blades. Oh my gosh. I'm getting so excited right now. <gasps> okay, so he dodged the blades. He got a reward. He completed the obby. A new record of one minute and two seconds. And for that, he seems to have got some kind of reward in the background. Let's see if we can see what it is. We couldn't see what it was but we're in the next area and there is your traditional giant chest it's got a damage of 1.73 billion so let's watch what happens he's gonna smash it he's gonna smash the chest no he's not uh, okay it's fast forward into well, hold on hold on this trailer moves so fast it's, fa it's fast forward into this triple egg hatch so let's see what he gets he got three of the same pet anyway let's keep moving on this is a uh, goldfish times three okay and then here's another hatch Bro, got three different pets, whatever. Kraken, jellyfish. Nice. By this music, man. All right, we're now in the next area. He is actually swimming right now. Preston is actually swimming in area 21. Oh my gosh. This is like Mario, bro. Wait, wait, wait. I just saw a machine. I just saw a machine. There is a machine. It's called Potions 2. So we've already seen the Potions 1 machine. This is a Potions 2 machine where you can buy random potions. I don't know. Who knows? We'll find out. Anyway. He is actually swimming. There is a swimming level right now. And I, oh my gosh, we're in the inventory and he has got a magnet flag. What is that, bro? It's rare. A portable magnet that can be placed in any area. It lasts five minutes. So instead of buying the magnet game pass for Robux, you can get a temporary magnet flag that you put down that possibly collects all the coins for you. There's some other stuff here, like a red dog bone, a tennis ball, a jar, some other flags. And this looks like a diamond flag. Maybe you put this down and you get more gems per second. Let's keep going and see what happens next. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hasty flag. Epic. Place in an area to supercharge your pets. It lasts five minutes. So there are a lot of free-to-play incentives to keep you playing. But if we rewind slightly, basic coin jar is rare. Drop a coin jar in the area you're standing in for rewards. Gonna keep moving and see what happens next. Okay, he just started a coin jar event. Now, I think that is the coin jar that we just spoke about. Maybe he's dropped it and it's a coin jar event. Let's just... Oh! Bro, did you see that? He dropped a coin jar and it's got two out of 500. So maybe it fills up. Let's watch. 
Is it filling up with coins? Yes, it's got 125 out of 500 coins. And he's got the hasty flag he's put down as well. So much is going on in this trailer. Hang on, hang on. Let's press play and see what happens. Okay, the coin jar is filling up. He is collecting coins. And now we're in another screen already. This is the rank reward screen. He's now ranked up to rookie. And you can see the star system here. Earn stars by doing these tasks. Break 90 breakables. Break 75 presents, blah, blah. And then you can claim stuff. Varies from potions to enchants for your character. And this, I don't know what this is, but we'll find out later in this video. Okay, let's keep going. He just claimed something. He claimed a bag of coins. But if we slow down a bit and watch, he hovers his mouse over there. So that's an epic diamonds potion. It temporarily increases increases diamonds you wear by 10%, lasts for 10 minutes. So you can see there are a ton of free to play things that they've put in. Right, let's keep going. Let's put it back up to half speed and boom. All right, what's going on right now? Uh, he's just mining for coins. Oh my gosh, look at this. He's swimming with a load of fish. I don't know where his pets are right now. Are those his pets? Those aren't his pets. His pets would be behind him, right? <gasps> wait, wait, wait. He's swimming. Are those his pets? I can't tell if they're his pets or they're just NPCs. I think they're NPCs. All right, let's see where he goes. He is just swimming. Wait, wait, wait. Before we go on to there, what is this portal in the background? Let's go back another second. There is this glowing thing there. Can you see that? No idea what that is. But wait, something just fell on his head. We are what looks like we're back to spawn area because we've got the fountain and this just fell out of the sky. Watch what happens. He's gone in it. Look at the animation. That is cool. He's just jumped to another area within the same map. So the teleport is now visual and real time rather than teleporting you without you seeing. So it shot him over the map. This has got Mario vibes to it, if you ask me. It is so much more cute and cuddly and... Oh, look. Look at that. He landed. There was a puff of smoke. The animations in this are sick. All right, let's keep watching. Let's keep watching because... Oh, my gosh. This is an egg machine. Open more eggs. What? Oh, my gosh. Instead of paying for three egg pass, eight egg pass, you can unlock open more eggs for free for free to oh my gosh this is free to play what is going on i can't believe this all right he's just unlocked more eggs and now now he's going to be able to hatch he can buy 11 eggs it says there one egg six eggs or 11 eggs which he has unlocked for free in the egg machine all right let's watch he's gonna oh my gosh there's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven eggs on the screen right now all right let's watch some more hatch bro that is sick what is that that looks like a legendary or something anyway let's keep going it's called a mantis shrimp. And you can see now when you hatch a lot of pets, instead of filling up your screen annoyingly, it just says you've got four jellyfishes and six goldfishes. So it's much more easier to focus on when you hatch a ton of different pets all at once, which is brilliant. All right, we're at my favorite machine. We are the gold machine. Gold. Golden pets. Okay, so this looks different, but same principle. Select some pets and then you can turn them into gold. Let's watch what happens. All right, he is going to select. Oh, did you see that? Hold on. Wait. Let me rewind, let me rewind, let me rewind, let me rewind. Oh my gosh. Watch this bit here. I'm going to slow it down even more. Okay, are you ready? Watch that. Look at that. It's like some kind of... Oh, that is sick. I don't know what he's doing right now, but let's watch and see what happens. He's got 20 pets selected there. He presses OK. More gold pets equals better. I don't know, but this is in real slow motion right now. You crafted new gold pets. He got two gold pets out of that. Okay. There. He's got six of these exist at the moment. No, doubt this is going to be millions when this game releases. All right. So he's got the goldfish. He has now jumped to another area. This is sick. He is jumping from area to area within the same world. And it's all visible on screen at once. This is sick. Look at that. Oh, imagine you're standing here right now and like five people just drop out of the sky. That is sick. All right, let's keep going and see what's next. Hang on, hang on, hang on. We've got fishing. The game has fishing like every other Roblox game, but let's see what he does. He picks up the fishing rod. New item found. You have found a fishing rod. Tap the water to fish. Okay, so clearly this game has fishing. Hold on, hold on. It's got the traditional fishing methods over here that are in all other Roblox games. Keep the bobber within the bar. Yeah, we know how to fish, guys. And he just got a jar. So I imagine all sort of things come out of there. Potions, jars, flags, all the enchants and rewards that we've seen so far. Anyway, strange thing, but why is there a bite in this coin over here? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So if you've ever played Pets in Player X before, you know what this is. This is the Fuse Pets machine. Combine pets together. Totally different style on everything. It's much more cartoony, which I really like. Everything has an outline as well. Anyway, let's see what he does in there. Anything? Anything? Or is it just a flyby? It was just a flyby, but hold on. This looks like that game. I've completely forgotten what it's called, but some kind of dig to the bottom of the blah, blah, blah. Anyway, what's this? He's got a shovel, new item, and he's literally digging down. And remember, it's in this square area. Just like we were talking about earlier, areas seem to be squared off with the tasks inside the boxes. I wonder why? I don't know. It's kind of sus, but let's keep watching and see where he digs to. He is digging. Oh my gosh. He is going further and further down. 
What is this, bro? He was getting coins for that. Wait, 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 wait. He was getting coins for that. Look. I've just noticed he's changed coins. We are now in Fantasy World. He's digging for coins in Fantasy World and he's getting Fantasy Coins. Remember, this was the second currency in Pet Simulator X and there's a return to the top button. So if you dig too deep, bang, press the button and you're back at the top. So wait, wait, wait. We are somewhere else now. It's moving on quickly. And once again, you can see these boxed off areas. Each area is boxed off and the stuff to do is in these boxes, such as collect coins and as we just saw, digging. But wait, what is this sussy pet doing down here? Anyway, let's keep moving and see. Wait, wait, wait. Can you see this pile of coins is glowing compared to the others? In Pet Simulator X, it would spit out coins if it had like a X5 or X50 on it. This is kind of like shimmering and glowing. Looks pretty cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. We've jumped areas again. We are now in what looks like the anime world from Pet Simulator X, but this is Pet Simulator 99. It is locked, but that is definitely some kind of Japanese castle right there. Oh my gosh. The obby that you always hate when the floor disappears and you can drop all the way to the bottom, it is back. He's 18 seconds into this obby. He is climbing the stairway to... Wait, wait, wait. No, not the dreaded red bar. I mean, I thought obbies were dead, but they've put obbies in the game, which is fine. Hold on. We've jumped again. We are now in a new area. Hey, unlock the door. He must have found the key to do this. And wait a second. Look how his pets curve around him. This is obviously the way they are dealing with the ability to have 99 pets. At the moment, you can see he's probably got about 20 something pets there. And in order for them not to just to span and fill up this whole area, they curve around him, which is pretty cool. And also, now that he's further into the game you can sort of see that all the currencies are displayed so strangely there's gold bars i don't know what they do yeah coins and this is another coin what could be like i don't know a snow coin or something there's your teleport button there's your hoverboard button this clicker here i'm not sure what this is but maybe it's to get through certain menus on mobile or i don't know we'll find out later i'm sure i don't know if you've noticed all along but down in the bottom right corner there is some kind of quest scroll which we haven't seen anything about it yet but furthermore we're going into this door and he's found a key and he's gonna unlock it are you ready He's going to press yes and boom, the door unlocks and behind is something else. Wait, wait, wait. Voting booth. Let him walk forward a bit. Oh my gosh. Voting booth coming soon. What is a voting booth? And oh my gosh, no, please. No, it's got a spinny wheel. This is just becoming like every other Roblox game. They've just put everything into this. Not just coin collection, but everything. So Leslie, oh wait, 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 wait. There's so much stuff going on right here. Hang on, hang on. We've got the trading plaza, which we know is probably just going to be the trading plaza. That's stuck around from Pet Simulator X. Crystal chest requires a key. I assume there is a bunch of crystals in there instead of gems. Wait, are they called crystals or are they called diamonds? I don't know. But anyway, we've got the spinny wheel, a free ticket available. You know what this does? You basically spin it and you get something. Now, these look like the enchants for your player rather than the pet. Voting booth is still coming soon. Oh, I've got no idea what that's going to be. Out. If you've got any ideas, comment and now like, right, let's keep going. This room here seems to be like the portal area to all the new... <gasps> what? The NPC just moved, bro. Hang on, hang on. Did you see that? What's this guy here? Where's he going? I thought he was just a statue. Maybe this game has NPCs. Anyway, we have been transported to another area. This is the VIP reward claim area. This is my favorite bit because it's pay to win cringe. Pay to win cringe time. So this must be at the beginning of the map somewhere. Oh, look. The pay to win area has... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's so many gem things in here. Look, up here, up here. Although this could just be cosmetic. And this is the area, because it's surrounded by a white box, this is the area where you grind gems. What is this? I don't know what this is, but it looks cool. So we'll just let it go past and we'll see what comes up. <gasps> His inventory is full of so much stuff right now. So he's got the fishing rod. He's got the shovel, which we saw earlier digging. Wait, wait, there's dynamite, bro. The tennis ball is back. The magnet we've seen. There's an orange. So these fruits, maybe they have the same effect as Pet Simulator X, where you get X2 this, X5 this. Wait, what is this? Comet, bro. There's also TNT. Oh, there's two parts to a key here. I think you have to use a machine to combine these two parts of the key together, but we'll find out soon. This is a coin pot with a bow tie on it probably gives you more stuff there's a full gold coin there you can see that part is connected to that part like this key over here and here is a multicolored fruit so let's see if it <gasps> he just hovered the mouse over the pineapple rare tasty stack for your pets increases chance for drops by one percent and it stacks so you consume this pineapple effectively your pets are eating it which pops up down here in the bottom times two thing here here is the orange again boosts diamonds by one percent so it's another kind of boost which stacks he's just equipped that and the banana tastes snack for your pets this one boosts coins by five percent all right let's keep going <gasps> okay this is the first time we're seeing the pet screen this is your team that is equipped right now much more clear because there's 13 of them equipped there's a nice dividing line so they've made it much more easier to see your pets equipped compared to, to your pets in your inventory so these are legendary huskies he's got 13 of 13 and below are all of the pets that he hasn't equipped right now let's watch what's going on here 
All right, we are in the ski area right now. He is collecting coins and a comet has been summoned. Let's just scroll back a bit because in his inventory here, we saw this comet thing here. This, he obviously clicks it. It summons a comet and then... Oh, there it is. The comet just crash landed. There's the comet and all these pets are attacking it and it's got a ton of damage. Wait, 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 wait. We've jumped to a new area again. Okay, within the box, we can see some weird stuff going on. This is some kind of lava world. I don't know which area we're in right now. I can't see any numbers that tells us where we are. But there is a giant coin jar that has just landed in the middle of the box. So let's watch what he does to the box. He's got a hasty flag pop down as well. Hold on. New items are popping up everywhere. So he's collecting new items from something. And that coin, look at those coins. Oh my gosh, the coins were filling up in the... Wait, 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 wait. It's jumped to another area, but let's go back a second. This jar is filling up with coins in real time. I'm gonna play that back. Are you ready? Look, it's filling up. Look at that. That animation is sick, bro. The animations in this are sick. Wait, 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 wait. This is a totally new machine. This is called a comet shower machine. You can activate it. He's just pressed it and it said, you started a comet shower, take cover. So everything's shaking and that, that's all we get to see. Let's watch it again. Okay, we're gonna watch it in slow motion. He's activated it, everything shakes, and I imagine at that point a bunch of comets come down, but we've now jumped to another scene. He's back in his inventory, he's got a lot more advanced enchants right now. Books that are glowing, books with pink hearts on, books with different colored belts on, each belt must mean something. And he's slotting them into his inventory. At this point he's got four of the five normal free enchant areas unlocked, but these are the premium ones which must cost Robux. Five free to play, and then six, seven, and eight, pay to win cringe. All right, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Treasure Hunter 5. This is a mythical enchant he has equipped in his inventory. Increases your chance of drops from breakables by 30%. Tap to activate. This is also tradable. Not only can you trade pets, which we're going to get to later in this video, but you can also trade your personal enchants. That is sick. All right, let's see the other one because he's moved his mouse. Okay, he's moved his mouse over to here. We've got Strong Pets 4. So this book is a Strong Pets 4 enchant. It's legendary. Increases the strength of your pets by 60%. Okay, let's see what else he does. He's taken them out of his inventory and he just swapped. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. He just swapped his inventory over to the lightning, which is also mythical. Chance to send bolts of lightning to nearby breakables. Oh my gosh, that is sick. So lightning must come from the sky and strike the coins for you. You don't even have to use your pets, bro. All right, let's watch. So he's just gone for one enchant at the moment. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He's now in the equip more pet screen. You can see he's made quite a lot of progress. We can't see how many pets he's got, but he has definitely got a lot of pets, judging by all of these collars. And you can see the pricing structure here. Gems mean everything in this game. Gems seem to unlock pets so we probably can get to 99 pets equipped with just gems let's wait and see and find out he's just unlocked another one and another one and another one wait where are we right now are we at the beginning of the map i can't even tell so we've got the social rewards area we've got group rewards what does group rewards mean bro can you join a group i think there's group competitive league team table i think there's group leaderboards possibly all right hang on the index so this is the pokemon machine view your collection why does it say vip only that's the, oh maybe that's in the background surely the index machine isn't for vip only pay to win cringy robots players you can see here his damage potion has run out anyway we're gonna press play he's got 57 pets which is one percent we're gonna press play oh he's in the pet collection machine okay so far he's collected 28 of 144 pets not only can you view your pets in the pets collection machine you can view the enchants that you've collected which are the enchants for yourself rather than the pets hoverboards and booths for the trading plaza which we're going to see very shortly all right let's watch what else he does in here here's all his enchants he's scrolling down there's a ton of them in there wait 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 he's doing things so far as treasure hunter 5 i think we've seen that enchant already anyway here this is the new one criticals for legendary eight percent chance your pet inflicts a critical hit so this affects, so these enchants seem to affect all your pets rather than pets having enchants. Wait, 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 that explains it. Mate, that explains why the dev the other day didn't reply to the tweet about enchants transferring over. Maybe there are no longer enchants on pets. Maybe there are only just enchants that you collect and equip on yourself. Okay, would you like to buy a Yeti egg? We have jumped to the shop again. We're at the Yeti egg and it uses what looks like a different coin. Hold on, he's got the ability to hatch 70 right now. He can hatch 70 at once. Is he going to press it? Let's see. He's going to press. He just pressed it. Oh my gosh. Look at that, bro. He has got 70 pets hatching on the screen right now. Let's... Oh my. Wait, wait, wait. What? That is just nuts, bro. It puts all the good pets in the middle. There's a snowman. I can't believe he just hatched 70 pets at once. That is insane. Okay, and then it's conglomerated everything. You've got 65 warruses, three frost dragons, one chip yeti, one snowman. The snowman seems to be blowing up gold right now. There, it says great. That is nice. That is nice. And the walrus is just, well, it's just a walrus. Okay, 
It's finished hatching and oh my gosh, we are seeing the first ever trading screen for Pet Simulator 99. He's on the server right now with Adam, aka Chicken Party, who you may have heard me talk about on Twitter all the time. Right now, Preston is hovering over his huge party axolotl exclusive and just confirmed there's no enchant. Oh wait, 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 what is this empty slot here? Can you equip that pet with an enchant? Don't know, but we're going to find out. This pet is a huge pet because it's got three question marks there and it says huge on it. But this is a brand new Titanic. What well, it looks like, I don't know. But this huge pet has leveled up to level 8. It has got XP. Each pet has XP. What the? There's a max XP of 168 and then maybe it jumps up to level 9. That has given the pet more damage. Bro, what else is going on in his inventory? He has got some other normal looking pets down here. So let's see what he does. He's put it in the trade. Has he? What has he done? There. He's put it in the trade. He's trading a huge party axolotl and another huge for this cool looking skeleton type pet. So this trader screen looks very familiar to what we... Oh, wait, wait, wait. This is epic. Only one exists. It's probably nothing. It's probably because the game's brand new. This trading screen looks completely familiar. Oh my gosh. We're in the trading plaza. This is the modern trading plaza. And as you can see here, this dude here, Adam, has got the Titanic Nightmare Cat from Pet Simulator X. But this, this is a brand new Titanic, bro. This Titanic here is completely brand new. Not seen it before. This is the one we were just looking at in Preston's inventory, right? Yes, there's Preston right there trading terminal trying to find a pet look no further so we know the trading terminal where you can go and find all the pets all over the trading servers just with one click that is making a return what else we got the glue we got the group we got the group rewards here and you can claim so we still don't know what groups are but we're gonna find out i'm sure social rewards this is just for following them on twitter or X as it's now known. You can see a few of the boosts in the background. This one costs Robux, this one costs Robux, and this one says purchase with diamonds. So that's pretty cool. Some free to play elements again. All right, let's see what's going on here. We got Jamian. Jamian is a dev at Big Games. You can see some of the pets he's got here. A lot of these pets look familiar. In fact, most of them look familiar. This pet here is definitely new. I've not seen this pet before. So let's keep going and see what happens next. These guys are just hanging out in the trading plaza. It's teleported back to the ski area. This is the ski area that we saw earlier. There is the chairlift of that we saw in a previous clip. All right, let's keep going. He's just panning through the world right now, showing how graph cute it is. And oh my gosh, this is an overview from above. So you can see the starter area there is the shop where you spawn. And we know the cannons hop you from area to area. And within each area, you can see these squares here where you actually do the work. All right, let's keep going and see what else is there. Come on, show us some more stuff. Wait, 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 wait. Rebirths have been confirmed. Rebirth one. You get tons of rewards. I'm not sure how people feel about rebirths. We're going to have to wait and see. Most people don't really like rebirths, but we know it does bring back a lot of replayability to a game, which is why they've included it. So let's just see what he does here. Rebirth one. You get a teleport. Travel anywhere by portable cannon. Portable cannon. Oh, wow. That means wherever you are, it drops the cannon down and then maybe you can hop like we saw earlier. That's pretty cool. All right. You also get strength thing. Pets are 75% stronger permanently. Okay. Rebirths are going to be a thing, clearly. Castle key. You get the castle key from rebirthing. So you can only progress through the game by rebirthing, it would seem. Access to the trading plaza is the key. Rebirth seems to get you access to the trading plaza. And the spinny wheel and more. And you get a bunch of rewards. Coins and areas will reset. You keep everything else. And then there's the rebirth button. So he's going to hit it. He's going to hit it. He's going to hit the rebirth button. And something's going on. He's gone inside the Titan. Titanic gold thing and there fireworks are going off a halo he seems to have turned out oh, there he's shot up through the halo into the sky and then we've got a white screen and it's pet simulator 99 oh my gosh so much in that video it's coming out december the first get your pets ready why not watch another video guys i will put it here go and click it just click it now. It's the best video you've ever seen. And it's something to watch whilst you're waiting for Pet Simulator 99 to come out.